Oh. Oh. Oh, man. I did it. Hey, in today's video, I'm going to show you how to take a dishwasher out and then put a new one in. Watch it, because you might find an easier way to do it than I did, because it took me all day. So check today's video out. Hi, right, welcome to today's video. Today I'm going to be replacing the dishwasher. Now I have tried to fix this one and I've replaced a part on it, but it's still not working. So we got a new one. Before you start removing things, you want to make sure your circuit is off. Do not need no electrocutions today. All right, some good things to have on hand are towels for water leaking out. Also, we need a drill. Possibly, you could use a saw to cut away some wood under the sinks just so I can access it better. And it always helps to have a flashlight. There is a valve here that I have replaced. It's like an electric valve, it controls water, but it was filling up with water, but it's not drying and things like that. I'm just, I really don't know. So we just went ahead and got a new one. All right, I'm going to undo these clamp, loosen these clamps up and I should be able to slide it out. You'll some pliers as well here. pull it out it's been a while since i did this so i'm having a hard time remembering but i know i'm gonna have to undo these clamps at some point so i may go ahead and get a screwdriver and do that now all right i need to get an electrical wire undid the drain hose Oh, oh, God, it smells awful. Oh. 
good. All right, I didn't show myself undoing it, but this is the water line. It goes to the dishwasher is where all the water comes from. I didn't show myself unhooking this, but this is it. It's got a elbow, made of brass, can't miss it. here drainage hose on this side so it's already on there it's like power supply here all right let's get this all plate pipe here comes over this side this drainage pipe will hook here and then connect to where the sink is This is for insulation, especially reduce noise. take the rubber piece that this pipe was smaller I had to take it off to put it on here and I'm over and I'm putting this drainage pipe on top of it and I want to seal it with these metal clamps hopefully it works the drainage pipe comes out down here at the bottom um, I may have to move this around a little bit just so to reach it or either cut a hole up here I'm not sure yet We'll be able to do this.
Alright, do that again. God. Man, this is everybody. I used the uh things that was attached to the wooden plank as a leveling legs so added those i'm gonna go ahead and wire this thing up that's the part i'm like stressing out about so when i got it tilted i'm gonna try to get this thing wired and and get that part over with and then hook the water up man we should be good to go all right all i have to do is hook the wires up hook the water up i'm done i had to go to ace and get some things to bind the wires together because this one does it a little bit different than the other one. It already has a ground wire hooked to the uh, dishwasher and you just need a cap uh, right here, which you saw I tried to, but these were too small. I was going to see if I could use it, but uh, so I went and bought some bigger ones. Let's get it done. Oh my goodness. Alright, just match the green. Well, if it's a copper one, it's usually a green wire. White with a white, black with a black. This is a GE washer. This is taking me most of my day. <laughs> but that part is done. Now I gotta somehow cap it off, which I'll do that later. I got these pegs too high, so I need to lower them. The water line is way back there, so I'll do that in a second. Well, this is supposed to go in there because it looks like it don't fit. I just cut the water back on in here and I'm doing like a trial run I could not get this thing square it's been a real pain but it's just gonna have to stay like this uh, I haven't peeled this all the way off yet but I'm just checking for leaks that's where it's going in uh, I haven't put the cover back on to 
reduce the noise. Seems to be working though. I'm more worried about it draining properly than filling up. It's getting power, so I definitely hooked it up right. Also, I figured out there's a screw that goes right there. That's what holds it on. So, still didn't fit as fleshly as I'd like, but it's on there. That cover. up putting all four of these pegs on and um just really had a hard time getting it balanced but it's in there I'm about to open it and see what it does all right let's try draining it and see what happens Checking for leaks. Thought it was draining. All right, I may just have to do a uh, let's do a one hour wash. See what happens. Show that thing in there. Oh. All right, there's a wire right in the way. Oh man, I did it.